Explain number five. Um, I didn't get 6A right. I put 62, but it was like 62.5. Tell me what you did. Tell me what your method is so that we can see what is right and wrong in it. I did um, 640 divided by 1,040, then times it by 100. Oh, I think I did it. Work out the percentage increase. Oh, to... I don't think I read that properly. Okay, read it again. What does it read the question for me? Work out the percentage increase no, in no, terms from the of start. Rent. From the start. This world is a shop that sells CDs and records. In twenty eighteen, Disco World sold eight thousand five hundred CDs and six hundred and forty records. In twenty nineteen Disc World then I mean sold six thousand eight hundred CDs and one thousand and forty records. Work out the percentage increase in sales of records between two thousand eighteen and two thousand nineteen. I think I was going to do one thousand forty take away six hundred and forty, then just work out from there. Okay, wait slowly, let's write that down. So you want to find the difference in the records, so you do let me write that down as you're saying them. Difference is 1,040 minus 640. What would that do that in your calculator? 400. You got 400. So what do we do now? Uh, do we do? You want to find the percentage increase. Um, not really sure. Right. What's the formula I said to you was percentage before the formula you copied? Um, which one? This one. Percentage increase it increased. Oh, do I divide that by um original uh, amount? Write this formula down. Because if you forget them, that's the end of the maths. Increase of original amount times a hundred. So the increase was four hundred. Divided by the original amount, 640. Yeah, I got this one right. 400 divided by 640 times 200. Can you see? Yeah. 62.5. Yeah. Okay, we're going to go to part B.